I'm Justin Crow, CEO of Parting Stone. We developed a technology called Solidified Remains that's an alternative to ashes for families choosing cremation. So when a family sits down in the arrangement uh, and chooses cremation, you can say we have two options for receiving remains, cremated remains or solidified remains, and the family gets to choose what they think they'll have a better experience with. And solidified remains looks like um, they look stone-like. Um, a hundred pound person is about 25 stones. And you have a background in ceramics. I have a background in ceramics and materials and um, we developed this technology uh, over about a year period with Los Alamos National Laboratory. Uh, we worked with material science scientists there through a grant. Um, yeah, to, and we went through hundreds of tests to figure out how to turn the, the granular cremated remains material into a solid. And so far, you launched in October of 2019. Launched in October 2019. Um, we're working with about 300 rooftops, uh, uh, funeral home rooftops, that we're onboarding over the next two months. And um, we're currently moving into, we'll be moving into a new space next month to expand our operation. And uh, yeah, it's been going really well for our first couple months. That's wonderful. Yeah. And what, what are people's reactions when they see what these stones look like? And they actually come out in different colors. Yeah, so one of the most interesting things we've discovered with this technology is that every set of cremated remains, the people come out a little bit different color and a little bit different texture. And so we've had everything from um, very white to kind of a blue or green hue to almost like a chocolate color or a honey color, but every set is unique. Uh, and that's been really, it's become kind of a part of the fantasy of solidified remains because I hear families all the time say, um, wow, everyone, you know, you, we can receive these remains in a form that we can touch and hold. I wonder what color mom's going to be. And it's really kind of a sweet, um, uh, really interesting part of this whole process. And one of the... Um results from getting the ashes turned into these stones, people may be more inclined to hold on to them. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, the problem we were trying to solve was that I, people, as most people in the funeral industry know, they receive the cremated remains and they put them in a closet because um, they're a little bit messy and they're a little bit uncomfortable and there's a lot of it and you're not really sure what to do with it. And you know, and after decades, then the grandchild has to take on the burden of figuring out what to do with that. And we're really trying to resolve that by creating a form of remains that was really going to empower people in their grief, something you can hold and touch and share with your friends and family. And we're really finding that families that didn't know what to do with the remains who were previously choosing the temporary cremation container are actually now choosing solidified remains. Interesting. So I assume you have a website. People we do can... have a website. Yeah, our website is www.partingstone.com. Well, I hope people check it out and wish you all the best. Great. Thank you so much.